Hey guys, how's it going? Today I'm gonna show you how to get smooth zooms in your content videos or videos in general. Today I'm gonna go step by step and show you how to get the script that you need to get those zooms. Obviously you can do it manually by keyframing and doing the graph editor yourself. But we all know when you're the content you have some sort of deadline so you have to be efficient and fast. And this is especially gonna help those guys who don't have an insane fast PC so this will speed up your work flow tremendously so first thing you have to go and do is go to description click this link this page will show up the name of the script is ease and whiz and it's free which is the best part obviously you can put your own price here you, you can donate to them how much ever you want go add to cart go to shopping cart i'm probably gonna speed this up probably not i'm not gonna do anything if you don't have an account you need to log in just log in with your account make it log in whoa leaked you go to place order and it says your order is received you go to your email and you just download the script. So once you download it from your email, you go ahead and extract it on your desktop. Open it up, copy ease and whiz and easing expressions. Go to local disk C, program files, Adobe, find your After Effects, go support files, scripts, script UI panels, and just paste those two in there. I'm gonna replace them since I already have them there. Once you do that, you have to restart your AE and you should have them. Once you open your After Effects, you're gonna go Window and right at the bottom, you're gonna see Ease and Wiz. You click that and it's, for me, it's gonna open up here because I already put it in this window, but it's, op it's gonna open up a little window for you guys. So right here, you can immediately see that there's a ton of options and presets that you can use. I'm not gonna go ahead and explain every single one in this video. On every each one of these there's like a preset that you can choose so what i usually do is i create a new adjustment layer put transform on it keyframe to zoom where i want it to be once i do that i press u to see the keyframes this is how it looks without ease and whisk let's pray for good team let's pray for good team and this is how it looks with my ease and whisk settings obviously enable motion blur let's pray for good team let's pray for good team let's pray for good team if you want it to be slower, just distance the keyframes. Let's pray for good team. Let's pray for good team. If you want it to be faster, shorten the keyframes. Let's pray for good team. Let's pray for good team. You guys can mess with the presets that they have. See what suits you the best. Make sure to click the link in the description for Ease and Wiz. And yeah, happy editing.